During these days, many are taking additional precautions to stay healthy. Washing hands for 20 seconds and practicing social distancing are key to preventing the spread of the virus. However, it's also important to have a strong immune system that can fight back against the germs you may encounter. If you've noticed that you're often sick, feel fatigued, or have other nagging symptoms you can't figure out, it may mean your immune system is weakened. In this video, you will learn six warning signs that may indicate you have a weak immune system. So make sure to watch this video till the end and subscribe to Your Health TV to get videos like this recommended to you every week. Here are six signs you have a weak immune system. Number one, your stress level is sky high. It's not a coincidence that you tend to get sick after a big project at work or following an emotional situation at home. According to a report by the American Psychological Association, long-term stress weakens the responses of your immune system. That's because stress decreases the body's lymphocytes, the white blood cells that help fight off infection. The lower your lymphocyte levels, the more you're at risk for viruses like the common cold. Number two, you always have a cold. It's perfectly normal for adults to sneeze and sniffle through two or three colds each year. Most people bounce back in seven to 10 days. During that time, it takes the immune system three to four days to develop antibodies and fight off pesky germs. But if you're constantly catching colds or have a cold that won't run its course, that's a clear sign your immune system is struggling to keep up. Number three, you have lots of tummy troubles. If you have frequent diarrhea, gas, or constipation, it could be a sign that your immune system is compromised. Research shows that nearly 70% of your immune system is located in your digestive tract. The beneficial bacteria and microorganisms that live there defend your gut from infection and support the immune system. Low amounts of these helpful gut bacteria can leave you at risk to viruses, chronic inflammation, and even autoimmune disorders. Number four, your wounds are slow to heal. Your skin goes into damage control mode after you get a burn, cut, or scrape. Your body works to protect the wound by sending nutrient-rich blood to the injury to help regenerate new skin. The healing process depends on healthy immune cells. But if your immune system is sluggish, your skin can't regenerate. Instead, your wounds linger and have a hard time healing. Number five, you have frequent infections. If you seem to battle frequent infections, your immune system might be sending you red flags. The American Academy of Allergy, Asthma, and Immunology reports that signs of possible immune deficiency in adults include having more than four ear infections in one year, developing pneumonia twice during a one-year period, suffering from chronic sinusitis or more than three episodes of bacterial sinusitis in a year, and needing more than two courses of antibiotics a year. Number six, you feel tired all the time. You know that burning the candle at both ends is bound to leave you feeling sluggish, but if you're getting enough sleep and still suffering from exhaustion, it's worth considering your immune system is trying to tell you something. When your immune system struggles, so does your energy level. That's because your body is trying to conserve energy to fuel your immune system so it can fight off germs. Here are some ways to boost your immune system. If the warning signs we discussed earlier are familiar, you need to give your immune system some extra attention. A few lifestyle changes and new habits can naturally keep your immune system strong and healthy. What you can do is eat a balanced diet, get enough sleep, exercise regularly, wash your hands, keep up with your vaccines, maintain a healthy weight, give up smoking, and try to minimize stress. So, those are the six warning signs that may indicate you have a weak immune system. Your immune system is the key to good health, so the more you can do to protect it, the better. If you found this video useful, make sure to hit that like button and share it with someone who might find this video helpful. Thanks for watching and see you again in another video.